last one, very fast video on the process we actually see or saw. It was halogenation was the last one, hydration, dehydration, alkylation, all these we saw. And you don't need to learn this by heart, but it will be okay if you at least know or recognize that, for example, halogen, halogenation implies the use of halogen containing catalyst. Uh, hydration and dehydration, alumina and magnesium will be okay. Mm, what else? Hydrogenation, you know it's a lot of metals, nickel, silver, etc. Oxidation, actually, uh, I cannot tell you a good th a rule of thumb, but you need to learn them by heart. And isomerization, I will say essentially cell lights are the good ones. And yeah, essentially, that was everything on this section guys next section is going to be more theoretical concepts on the catalytic reactions what's up guys it's me chemical engineering guy so if you like the video why not push the like button it really helps me to know if you're liking the videos or if I should be changing something or if I should be adding something, taking out content, whatever. Also, sharing is caring. So if you got any kind of friends, teachers, colleagues or whatever kind of person that might be interested in this type of content, why not share it? Sharing helps our community to grow faster in members and in content. If you want to keep track of my activity, videos, uploads, experiments, playlists, whatever content I'm getting on YouTube, be sure to click the subscribe button. Subscribing to the channel is totally free, guys. My dream is to create an online academy of chemical engineering, where everyone can access it in the world. Imagine a place in which the student, the teacher, and the engineer get the best of each other. Thank you, thank you, thank you guys for the support and the love.